just below the historic stone face rock lies the old Coal Creek Country Store, which is now abandoned with a kind of a sinister past, a dark history, if you will. Named after the fresh water source that comes from right near this Cold Creek store. It was opened back in the 30s and closed in the 1990s. In the 1970s, a dark murder happened here. A sheriff was actually shot and killed right inside this store over some disagreements with some locals. All right, guys, we are inside the old Cold Creek store. And right in here is where the sheriff was shot and murdered. Here is what used to be the kitchen of the store where they prepare food. It looks like some old pill cases here. Oh, pinks. And look at all these old books. I guess they may have sold books here. There's lots of old books and stuff here. There's a suitcase. There's the turtlet in there. These floors are flooded. And I'm afraid it's all coming from upstairs. I'm pretty sure it is. There's an old you see some of the water coming from sogging down right there. Yeah. If you look over here, I mean, it's definitely coming from up here. It's wet. I don't know how safe the floors will be up there. I stepped into that water and it's got like a slime on it. Ew. Yeah. It's definitely a creepy building. Looks like 1997 was the last calendar here. So it was in here that the sheriff was shot and killed. Now, judging by these floors, it does not look safe to go upstairs. Now, I Guys, across this trestle is a very epic looking tunnel. Wow, I'd love to get into that one. But there's a highway down here that we'd definitely get caught walking across that if we tried to do it in the daytime. Maybe there's a way to get to it from the other side. Could be. Could be. But we got two other epic tunnels right here we can get to. That is right behind Tim top of that peak you go down about three of those boulder blocks and you oh, see I what see. looks like an opening just across from that right tree. there that my friend does look like an opening to some kind of cave my favorite tunnels are like these the ones that's been carved in the rock look at all the ice it's very cold very very cold yeah, the last time i stepped outside the, look at those the train line i went into deep mud I wonder if the train's been running because that's kind of chipped off. These tracks don't look like they've been used much, if any, but there's rocks falling. Yeah. I hear that these are inactive. I don't know for sure. It's 
It's definitely a creepy ambiance in here. Yeah, all the blast marks. What a crack. Oh wow. Your light fooled me because I just saw a corner of my eye and I thought it was behind you. This is just cool, guys. It is so cool in here. There's another tunnel right over here. We're gonna go check it out. See what it looks like. Tunnel keeps trying to see on the camera. Yeah. Guys, if you look here, there's a tunnel right there, right below the historic stone face rock. Let's go walk underneath of the stone face rock. Let's go rock inside of the stone face rock, yes. There's the stone face. Here is the tunnel. Not a very long tunnel, kind of like the other one. What's wrong? It's just you always get this eerie feeling that you Afraid something's gonna come while you're standing right here. Yeah, it's been caving in some. Not very safe, for sure. See what it looks like from this other side. Yeah, you can tell it's been a minute since the train's been on here. Yeah. Looking at the limbs laying across it. Oh, yeah. I've heard that this track is no longer in use. And here's the back side of Stone Face. We went right underneath it, Mr. Tim. We did. You notice these weird patterns here in the rock face. Just as you're about to enter from the back side of the tunnel here. And I can't help but look at all this fallen rock here and just think how dangerous this is. Just look at that. Yeah, I was just walking along and I noticed there's two full rows of pennies here. Just laying on the tracks. Those look like some old uh, rolls yeah. too. Huh. Interesting. All right guys, these are pretty cool tunnels. Um, I want to come back maybe at night sometime, walk across that bridge, or maybe even see if there's another way into that other tunnel from the other side. Stay tuned for that.